Frontier here. Welcome to another Warframe video. We're going to be talking about the Fomorian Disruption mission today. Which is, I figured I would do this now, even though it may not be live when you're watching this video, because it only comes around every once in a while. When you do invasions to support either the Grenier or the Corpus, there's a little meter underneath the part where it is. And once the Grenier one fills up, we get the Fomorian Disruptor event. This is it. All right. So you need the Fomorian Disruptor in your gear wheel. And you need Omega Isotope as well, which you can get with by non arc with non arcwing enemies that are wherever the Baylor Fomorian is camped out at. So, nanospores, Omega Isotope, and Cryotic. I'm going to just run a mission for that just to see if we can get a little bit of it. And I, the wiki specifies non arcwing enemies, so wherever it's camped out. So right now this says we can just take a look at it. Annihilating the Cronia Relay, that's on Saturn. So we go over here. Here we can ignore this. And it'll say the Baylor from Orion right here. And then we just non arcwing enemies. We can do capture, like we can do whatever we want. I'm pretty sure if I have this correct, it doesn't even have to be an arcwing mission for you to do that. It's just a non arcwing. The wiki specifies non arcwing enemies on the planet where the Fomorian Sabotage mission is present. Oh, in mission, players engage in their arc wings. Oh, okay, that's once we get to it. Okay, we'll get to that here in a bit, though. I just want to see if I can get some Omega Isotope for funds. Uh-oh, I forgot I had this on public, and now we got Storm Pisces 0939 with us. Very cool. This is a capture mission, anyway. I'm um, leveling Chroma for you the Profit Taker thing because uh, he is only level 12 and he wants to be a big dragon when he grows up. Sit on a big hoard of gold. Right now he's got something like five bucks under the pillow. Let's see if we got some isotope. That took way too long. Turning into an exterminate. Okay, we did get some Omega isotope. Also... Whether for good or for ill, I have a booster that doubles pickups, so if it does work on this, it's likely only three isotope. Alright, so now after you make sure the Baylor, the Fomorian Disruptor is in your gear wheel, you want to go up here. I suggest, like, bring your strongest arc gun and your best arc wing. I, I hate this. I hope I can do this correctly. I, I hate this mission because of the close quarters. It really bugs me. So basically what happens is uh, you go, you shoot the little things on the outside to break the shields. Then we go inside. Then there's this thing like a spiked ball with rubber stoppers on it, which we're going to shoot. And then once we shoot a bunch of those, we shoot the center as well until we can't. The Lotus tell us to get lost. And then we leave. Okay, these red Shield things, there we go. Down. Down. No. Get okay, we gotta get inside over here. This is the part that bugs the heck out of me. Gotta go over here. We gotta kinda wait for the people There's to the get in here with Deploy. me. Then in three seconds, the little tell us we got a boogie. If this is real important, you gotta go through that area and get out as quickly as possible because that's actually going to start closing to trap you in. Alright, so 5 million damage. That's that's cumulative, I think, amongst everybody and 2,000 credits and whatnot. So, get a message in the old inbox. And yep. Inbox messages await the operator. And you get 200,000 credits in an orc and catalyst. But anyway, I appreciate you guys hanging out. That will be it. Be sure to like, favorite, subscribe, ding the bell on all that YouTube jazz. If you enjoyed this content, if you learned something new, or if you had fun today, keep on going with your gaming journey and your life journey too. We will catch you all in the next one. See you.